All right, guys, welcome back to the average day in the life of the heathen. What I'm going to do here today is I'm going to take the plug out this air compressor, try to look at it. I'm going to go ahead and take it off that stand, too. Y'all see how it's on that stand? I'm going to go ahead and take that off. And we ain't never inspected the integrity of this here. The pump works, but we ain't never pumped it all the way up just to see. Y'all do understand that becomes a bomb. If it, uh, guys with the top of this tank looking like this I'm pretty sure the integrity of that tank ain't the greatest it don't look too good at the top I'll tell you that it sit outside for in a shop and on the outside for years this is the top plug now see what the top plug looks like let me go get my flashlight take a look down inside there All right, guys, already this compressor, it belonged to an old man that set out in the shop like eight years after he died. Doors open, exposed to the elements. And I think you see how he's got it mounted to this here. Uh, I don't know what the hell you call this cart. You got this pad with wheels on it. I don't think he drained it every time he used it. Y'all see what the top. It's the top plug, what it looks like right there, so it's pretty bad. That's the top plug. Let me just take a quick look, see if I can see down in there a little bit. Kind of got rust all over it, yeah. Top don't look too bad, the very top don't look bad, but all the rest of it from here down is pretty well rusted out. Which, I mean, that ain't going to guarantee that it's going to blow it up, but probably going to go ahead and take the compressor off, off the tank, take the tank off the pad right there, cart, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to make a barbecue pit out this here tank. It's been $900 to get a brand new tank for the compressor. Let me get out my wrenches. <laughs> 